Jamison Tyone today, really solid. Six and a third innings, allowed just one run, struck out six, 96 pitches. Let's hear from the Yankee right hand. Hey, Jamison, what was the biggest difference for you on the mound this afternoon? Yeah, I thought uh, my last start against the A's, I thought I had a lot to build off of, and then today was kind of just like a continuation of that. I had some time to let that A's start marinate and uh, pick what I liked from it and stuff, and I felt like I carried that over today well. So um, mixed the four-seam and the two-seam fastball. was throwing the curveball more aggressively. was throwing it for strikes a little better than I have been all year. I uh, got some quick outs on the changeup, which uh, helped keep the pitch count down, and then that took some pressure off the slider, and it didn't have to be like my primary pitch today. So that was kind of just a nice complimentary pitch. You mentioned the curveball. Aaron Boone mentioned that pitch mm -hmm. as well. Why did that play different for you today? What, what made you throw it more aggressively? Yeah. Um, after that Philly debacle start, uh, I kind of was just curious where my curveball went because my whole life that's been my best pitch. That's been something like – no matter what I'm taking out to the mound that day, my curveball is usually something I can really count on on being there in big spots and stuff. And up till that point, it really hadn't been there for me at all this year. So, um, you know, in between starts, I messed with my grip a little bit. I was messing with my mentality on it a little bit, my sights a little bit. Uh, and then I thought against the A's it was better. And then I thought today was another step forward with it. You've spoken a lot over the, the last couple of weeks about pitch mix, about pitch selection in, in certain spots. Just how satisfying is it for you to have it click in an outing? Yeah, yeah. I mean, it's nice to have it all come together a little bit for an outing, uh, especially, you know, coming into today, having the series split, this being the deciding game of a series, I really wanted to go out there and just give us a good shot to win. So um, definitely feels good leaving here with a win, um, you know, going into Boston with a series win. But yeah, the pitch mix was definitely a lot better. Um, you know, I didn't feel like I backed myself into a corner and had to rely on just one thing. I felt like I kind of had everything going. Jake Siner, please unmute. Hey, Jameson, this is the, uh, the first uh, time in over a month the Yankees have won a game by more than four runs, getting sort of a, an easy start to finish blowout win like that. Uh, I'm curious, both as the guy on the mound, what's the, the benefit for you just getting that big lead early and being able to cruise a little bit? And are you getting a, a sense of, of relief or any other emotions at the clubhouse just having gotten a game like this where you guys can, can cruise into the finish like that? Yeah, um, man, our lineup wore that starter down for them. They wore Keller down pretty hard from the get-go. Uh, I don't think he had one easy inning all day. Uh, there was just traffic on base, a lot of three-ball counts, a lot of walks, a lot of hard-hit balls. Even some of the outs we made were hard-hit balls. Um, so, yeah, I mean, once you get a lead like that, you can go out there and really be aggressive, especially in the later innings. Um, it allows you to not have to be too fine. Like, the lineup's seen me two, three times. Um, but, you know, when you have a lead, that doesn't quite matter as much. You can just keep really, really going at guys. So, um, yeah, I mean, it was a nice one for the team. I thought the lineup did a, did a great job. Even last night, just some of the at-bats, being able to walk that many times, that kind of tells me as a pitcher that they're, they're seeing, seeing the ball well and they're tracking the ball well. So uh, it was nice to see it come together.